What's up, man? It's Chester Pitts. So big love to the Texas player. Thank you, Sam. Yeah, I played at Cypress Creek High School, played basketball, um, ended up going to college to switch to football. Um, so, just made a little switch, man. I was, I was born with a hip condition and with basketball, the hard wood was making my hips hurt, so yeah. ended up switching to football. Okay, 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 okay. So, tell us about uh, where we're at right now, what's going on right here? Uh, we're all in sports performance. I feel like it's... What's what's all in? First of all, what's all in? Good question. A lot of people ask me that, or a lot of people that don't know, they just tie it to my last name because it is my last name. But um, all in was created when I was in depression. Okay. And for me, it's uh, it's a reminder every day that you got to be all in to everything you're doing, no matter what happens, uh, through the ups and downs. And that's that's how I created the name, and it's it's a lot of people call it a brand, but I like to call it a movement. Okay. So how long have you been um having all in? I uh, created it in 2015, but I didn't bring it out until um, mid 2017. Okay. Um, so about it's probably been created about four years. Yeah, it's really hot out here. So um, let's talk so, about this man, field. This is where the magic happens. Sort of the, 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 the fundamentals of the game of football. Okay. Um, from Four years old, all the way up to professional athletes come out here, and we we uh, perfect their craft. That's um, so why I learn stuff daily, learning from them, um, learn from each player. Uh, the basketball court is that hoop dreams, man. I told you I played basketball in high school, yeah. so every now and then I come out here and shoot. Okay, shoot so, a few hoops. so I mean, are you able to shoot hoops on this on this turf? Here? Yeah, I mean, if you a hooper, you know how to. It's gonna bounce a little different, but yeah, that don't go. That don't go away. Okay, okay. Well, let's take a look on the inside. Tell us about the uh, building. And the building on the inside, that's more the sports performance side where we keep the athletes healthy, getting quicker, stronger, faster, explosive. Um, I like to focus on the core. That's where everything really starts at. starts in the middle, so. How y'all doing? It's Justin Allen, uh, training at All In Sports. Uh, I'm from Houston, Texas. Um, to be honest with you, how I got started in the training, um, I had a career in the injury, and it just brought me back to my childhood of not having the, the trainers, uh, the guidance, and the support to uh, play, play or train at a young age. So I wanted to be able to, to give the youth uh, a different perspective and uh, something that I didn't have growing up. Uh, probably around 2014, uh, I had double hip reconstruction in 13, and in 14, when I realized I wasn't going to be able to recover, uh, it, just, it just took my mind into a whole different place, and uh, I just wanted to be able to help others, and I didn't want them to experience what I experienced by having my dream um, taken from me. Um, I was no longer able to play, and I just wanted to help others understand that they're more than athletes, and that uh, the, the route I took to put my whole life into sports. Uh, I didn't know anything else, so um, it was a no-brainer for me to give back to the uh, Basketball. Basketball is my favorite sport. Uh, Rockets. I'm a James Harden fan. Uh, I'm excited about it. I think, I mean, they've already played together. They proved they can play um, alongside one another. I feel like at this uh, stage in their career, they'll be able to put it together. Um, I think if I think if, it, if they have a chance to win it, this will be the year. You got, you got Duran out, you got Clay out, you got to take advantage of that. Uh, my, my ultimate goal is to um, inspire people to understand that uh, no matter what you go through, um, I mean, no matter what, to accept what you go through and, and understand that there are going to be ups and downs and, and to uh, learn to weather the storm. Um, I think that's what a lot of people have a problem with. They, 
once that adversity hits or it's not to their liking and they're uncomfortable, um, they tend to give up. And I think through the fitness world, um, I can help change that. Because um, it's more mentally uh, for me than anything. Um, a lot, anybody can be a trainer, anybody can help you reach your, your, your physical goals, but um, it's the aspect of life that I enjoy. And it's, it's helped me take control of my own self when I was in depression and understand that I'm more than just an athlete. And um, I can pass that knowledge down through general fitness and through sports. Tell the younger me, uh, stop stressing. Um, and I, I really wouldn't change anything, though. I think I needed to go through everything I went through. Uh, I would just tell myself everything's going to be all right. But other than that, I, I really wouldn't change anything because that's what helped me uh, be who I am today and who I'm becoming. Oh, man, we got a free camp for the, for the, really the, for the city of Houston. I uh, want to give back to the community. Um, and give these these kids something to look forward to. Um, let them know that they're not alone and we care more about them um, than they know. Um, and just give them something exciting leading up to the school year. Teach them the fundamentals of football, have them around um, some big name NFL guys and um, some just great guys in the city, um, women as well. So just excited to, to give back to the youth. Uh, they're gonna, it's it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to bring some energy um, and just – uh, give the kids a message through um, the game of football. So for everyone interested in, in to what we do at All In Sports, uh, you can visit our website at www.all-ensportsperformance.com and all the prices and um, services are uh, provided online. To be honest, I feel like uh, it's, a, it's, it's more than just a training service. I'm, I'm going to help you. I can help you reach your, your physical goals, but I can also help you, you know what I'm saying, with the, with the tough times in life. Uh, I mean, they can look forward to, to a lot of fun, different energy, different vibe, uh, as well as meeting their goals um, that they want to do for themselves. Most definitely. Uh, uh, I want to give a big shout out to uh, Jay Hill, man. He doesn't get a lot of credit for what he does, but he helps me a lot. Um, more than just through the sports. Uh, I've been through some things that he's helped me through. Um, that's like my big brother. Uh, he's my business partner. Also, uh, Ronald Ali. A lot of people give me credit for helping him, but he's helped me a lot because I got to see him at his worst and got to see him. I got to see Ronald Ali at his, at, I got to see him when he, when he was on his, at his lowest and I got to see him as he's reached his dream to play in the NFL. So, um, those two guys have, have helped me uh, tremendously along the way. Oh man, uh, 2020, I got big big things uh, planned for the movement. Like I said, I don't like to call all in a brand because I feel like um, it's everybody. Like we we all together. Once we can, once every, we all realize that um, we can help one another. You know what I'm saying? Without using one another and just look at the bigger picture, I feel like everything would be a lot better. Just allowing people to understand that it's okay to fail and it's okay to not be where you want to be uh, because uh, it's preparing you for, ooh, you, man, you, man, it's a lot I can say with that one. But for sure, when you walk out that door and you sweating as soon as you, the door ain't even closed and you sweating, man. You know you're in the age. Uh, all my social media are the same. You can find me at Justin Allen underscore 13. Um, that's my Twitter and my Instagram handle. Uh, that's my number in college. Played at New Mexico State, you know, war number 13, so um, I didn't get to finish what I started, so I do that.